And over the years, I've helped more than a million people, probably close to two million people, start composting either in their backyard or through curbside collection programs. But this time of year, I always feel a little bit badly because it's fruit fly season and people can end up with fruit flies in their kitchen. So I'm going to show you how to build your own very effective fruit fly trap. I guarantee it'll work for you. So all you need to make a very effective fruit fly trap is a bit of red wine and use red, not white. Red works better. You pour a little bit in a glass. You take a little bit of plastic wrap, saran wrap or any other kind. Stretch it over the top of the glass so that it is tight. Like so. Take a fork and just poke, poke a few holes in to the glass like so. The fruit flies will be attracted to the wine, will go through the holes, and they'll have a hard time getting out. In fact, they pretty well can't get out. This thing will clear a kitchen of fruit flies in no time at all. It's very effective, guaranteed. So there you go, folks. That is a very effective, oh, there's one right now. There's a very effective fruit fly trap. See, they're already going for the wine and it will clear a room. I can tell you that I once came home from a cottage trip. Um, I'd been gone for a weekend and when I opened our door, um, I walked in and it looked foggy in the room. There were so many fruit flies. I built one, of, or, well, built two or three of these, put them out on the counter and uh, within 24 hours there wasn't a fruit fly to be found except in the glass where they um, they come in through the holes, they get stuck in there, and they'll eventually drown in the, in the wine. So I hope this helps you with your fruit fly problem, and please keep composting. It's good for the environment.